Hey guys, welcome back for another update on this sawmill shed that's more like a barn uh, build. So this week, uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna continue notching the post that are we got up right now. Um, we kind of started on that last week, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and finish notching all those posts, and then we can put in, I believe they are the ledger boards, and that's what the floor joist for this kind of loft that's going to be above the shed, uh, that's what those floor joists connect into. Hopefully we'll get all that done this week, but we'll see. Well, we probably all heard the uh, the old adage or proverb of measure twice, cut once. And that's exactly what I did. I measured twice, cut once, but it doesn't do you any good if you uh, measure twice incorrectly. And I, I, I may have done that. On two of these posts, um, exactly two inches, uh, the notches that I cut are two inches low. Uh, and I was wondering why these these ledger boards weren't fitting in right. It's like they just they just weren't sitting in quite right. And I stood back and I was looking at it and I said, that something's not right there. And I know exactly what I did. The wind was blowing, and I've got a little block that I use to measure down to. That's my level line um, that I'm using the water level. And I put a block there so I can measure down to the top of that block. Well, the wind was blowing, so I hooked the measuring tape underneath the block, and I forgot to add two inches extra on top of that. So I had two of these posts come out uh, with notches two inches too low. So I kind of pondered over my options with that. I came up with a few different ideas. And I think what the best way is going to be to uh, remedy this little issue is to jack this sill beam up because these two posts are side by side. They're on the same beam. So we're just going to lift the post up. Uh, we're going to put some space, or not the post, but the sill beam up. We're going to put some rocks that are right at two inches as spacer rocks underneath there, and we'll call it good. All right, guys, this is going to be it for this video. Uh, next week we'll be working on getting these posts up 
on this back wall here and getting the ledger boards on that and uh, connecting them over to this section that we already have up and making sure that they're nicely shored up uh, since it's just kind of a single wall back there. Appreciate you guys watching and you'll see me in the next video.